I'm Toffee, I'm from Luton, I'm 20 years old and I'm bisexual. One of the problems I faced when people knew I was bisexual was that it changed the ways in which I could talk to people. Um, whereas I used to like have jokes with people and you know we'd all tease each other or rag on like you know some people just for fun or to entertain ourselves I lost that ability because actually what's key in those sorts of interactions of like of banter is actually deep down everyone acknowledges everybody else there as an equal what I discovered was actually I could never be seen to make fun of anybody else because actually my sexuality was a mark against me um, that was far that far outweighed anything that I could ever say about anybody. So um, it sort of really devastated my ability to actually sort of relate to other to other to the other boys in my year because actually it would turn things like we used to say like deep. It would turn things like serious because actually it's one thing to make fun of someone's like clothes or haircut or whatever, and it's quite another thing to say that they're existence on this earth is like, I don't know, denigrating or less than. Um, and I guess the time when I experienced this most sharply was when um, my athletics team, we went on a track meet to Oxford and we all got off the coach and we all went down to the toilet because it had been a long coach journey. And of course, we there was no toilet on the coach because there never is. And I used the toilet after my teammate, um, he used to be one of my closer friends, um, comes out and I see that he doesn't wash his hands after using the toilet. And so I pulled him up on it afterwards, after I came out of the bathroom. And he said, you can't talk to me about being disgusting because you like having sex with men. And in that moment, I understood that actually he found me more repulsive than his own objectively unhygienic behaviour. He found me less than than his own excrement, you know, like it it was sort of a devastating comment to hear and it just I guess it dashed all hopes of there ever really of any relation of any friendly relationship existing between us because actually there's no way to come back from that. You don't talk to that person anymore, you know, like there's no point.